friends, it's Memorial Day weekend. And champagne, it's Saturday. I'm going to be barbecuing tomorrow, God willing, with my family. So you know what that means, another Walmart haul. Yay! All right, so let's see what we got. Let me bring you guys closer. Of course, the basics. I got some burger buns. I did two packs and hot dog buns. So sometimes we'll have the hot dogs without the buns, to be honest. Then, of course, my sister's visiting. So I got her and her husband's favorite juice, which is the passion fruit. The Chino La Welch. It's really good, but it's super sweet. So sometimes you have to dilute it with water. And that's just that. Capper Sun for the kids. Some peppers to make some sofrito. What else? I got a Coca-Cola. I usually get Diet Coke, but my sister, the, the other one is gonna be here and she loves to have her Jack and Coke, so I got her the regular Coke. Pa que no se queje. Then I have some for Monday morning, some Gatorade. I think I have a blue one in there somewhere too. Tonight they're coming in pretty late. Let me see, is that better? probably better tonight they're coming in pretty late because they're driving down from out of town so i got these shrimps so i can make like a shrimp linguine pasta it's kind of wet so i'm not going to take it out the wrapper but yeah it's peeled and deveined i just have to clean it and season it and i'm going to make like a pasta with it if you guys want i can record it i'm gonna record it for just 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 in case and then i got some sun kiss i got the minis because you know how it is when you're out in the sun, you want a little bit of soda, but if you get the regular ones, it'll go flat with the sun, it'll get hot fast, so you might not finish it. So I got that one. Then, hold on. Okay, I brought over more bags. Then I also got Dr. Pepper, which is my little sister's favorite soda, the minis, of course. So there's that. I got some rolls of napkin, I mean paper towels, the cheap ones, cause why not? I have some milk for my nephew, and we'll use some for cereal or anything like that. They're gonna be here long, so he's not gonna drink all of it, but whatever he doesn't drink, I'll make sure we consume so that it doesn't go to waste. I got some thin pork chops for the grill, which is not bad. All of this for seven bucks, not too bad. I usually get my meats at Bravo, but I didn't wanna do too much, so. Then I have this like steak, which I'm gonna season up and throw on the grill as well. Let's see what else we got. Okay, I did two packs of this linguine pasta. Great value, of course. I'm gonna make that later, like I said. I got some Lunchables for my baby. My nephew, he loves to snack. He's not a big eater. He, I don't know if he's going through a growth spur or what, but he's not eating too much these days. So I try to make sure he has enough snacks. Let me have a sip of my champagne. More uh, Gatorade for tomorrow. Or for Monday, for whenever really. Like if you're out in the sun, you wanna try and make sure you get some liquids in. You don't always want water and it's good to get some electrolytes. My favorite hot dogs, the Bun Lang Nathan. Basic. <laughs> so yeah. Then I got some plates, the big pack. Cause we're not doing dishes all weekend. And what else did I get? Oh, some Oreos. When did Oreos get so expensive? This was like five bucks for a pack of Oreos. Like, I don't know. I haven't bought Oreos in forever. As an adult, I can't, I could probably count on one hand how many times I've bought Oreos, but I don't remember them being so expensive. Things are getting out of control. Then I got some Parmesan cheese. Oh, there's a hole in here. No wonder the pasta fell through earlier when I was walking in and I'm like, where did it fall from? I guess it was from this bag. Then I have some Ziplocs because I'm going to season the meat tonight. I'll put them in Ziplocs so tomorrow they'll be ready to throw on the grill. And then I got this little Vienna sausage. I used to love these when I was little, like cut up. Like you cook it on the stove, cut it up and put like lime over it. So maybe my nephew will like that. I know he's not... He's not eating too much these days. He's in that picky toddler stage. So I'm gonna try and feed him as much as I can while he's here. On that note, I also got his favorite chippies. He loves these chips just like me, but these have gotten expensive. The big bag is like almost $6, but this was on sale. So I got it right at the counter as I was leaving. Then I have some turkey burgers. I like these and my mom doesn't eat beef. So those are for us. And then 
the beef burgers, of course. Ain't no barbecue without the beef burgers. And then what? Oh, some onions. Let's see what else. Okay, this is the final bag. Let's see what's in here. Oh, another one of the cheap paper towels, which comes in handy when you're by the grill. I got him some of these. These were on sale. He loves gummies and he's kind of growing up out of the cocoa melon, but it's gummies. And then the other ones were like twice the price for the, what's that cartoon, the Chase, the Paw Patrol, which he really loves, but I'm gonna go with the cheaper options. So cocoa melon it is, or cocoa yo, that's what he used to call them. Cocoa yo, um, these so that while I'm grilling, I just throw the meat on there, put the lid on, because you know how those flies are we're done and then the last item is some aluminum foil i usually use these sheets that i got on amazon that are like reusable you throw them on the grill they're black um and then when it's time to go you clean them and you put them away but they have been so hard to clean like i don't want to be wasteful but i think tomorrow i'm going to use the aluminum foil instead huge mistake i'm going to do a story time on how i literally caused a small fire using those cheap foils the I don't want to be wasteful but i do want to make my life a little bit easier at least for this weekend the last time we grilled it was so hard to clean it so i think i'm going to use that tomorrow and see if that goes better for me so yeah i'm really excited and i hope everyone has a safe and fun memorial day weekend i'm going to try and record as much as possible but as always thank you guys for watching cheers